uh, movie of the summer. Yep. Who's up next, man? Who's on stream next? We just saw uh, McLeod vs. Mason. It was a bit of a smack up, but that's Peach Ice. He's McLeod. Uh, Mason put up a fight. Brutal, yeah. No, but. Uh, uh, that's the one matchup I expected for Syndicus vs. Josh was actually really entertaining. Syndicus was playing very cool and confident. Yeah, the confidence from from Sindo was was very best. No I'm one is I'm walking up. Josh is playing Fox. Yeah. Oh, we got McDoog again. Oh shit! Against the young, another Chibay? young Victorian star, Chibay the Moth, the up and comer in the beanie. You'll see him. This is his first uh, tournament out of state, I believe. Is that right? He's a young man. He doesn't travel very often. He doesn't have the means to, but he's here. No Phantom, no... I don't, I don't believe so, no. I don't believe he was at Phantom. Well, he looks excited to be here. I hope he is, man. I hope he is. He, he's a grinder. He's been trying to put in work. But uh, kind of, I feel like in the last month or so, maybe struggling to find his footing in tournaments. Yeah. But uh, that's maybe because he's got new ideas ruminating. Mm, new uh, concepts. You know, two steps forward, one step back, you know? Yeah, yeah, and for Chibe, I think that's a good way to think about it because for a while he was very much in the in the dash dance, in the corner, down to down to kind of wave. Yeah. But that only gets you so far. The, the way you kind of get better is you can't rest on your laurels. You can't just do the thing you were doing, but slightly better. Uh -oh. that like, I changed the pools to, like, deal with the XP tiered snurt pool like oh, no. four times over and it still ran that way. Yeah, XP was telling me. I don't know. You know, I'm right here, but um, that's, well, that's I think annoying. Like, I've been communicating with people about it and like, yeah. Yeah, fair. I'm sure it was just like a, yeah, you know, as a classic man. Too many moving uh, They're parts. getting into it. Here we go. Chibi looking clean so far on the tech chase. Ooh, drops that one. He almost had it. He's moving so far though. I kind of, I kind of like the, uh, the dashes, walling him out. Speaking of walls, McLeod on one. With punish. I said it once. Uh, I'll say it a million times. The sign of a good moth is how good they are versus floaties. Ah, true. And uh, Chibe, no slouch. It's kind of hard to know. Victoria doesn't have a lot of, you know, a lot of Peach players or like you know any Samuses really. So it's. It's tough to know how good, how proficient Chibe is, but we're going to leave here up against McLeod game one. Moving so hard right now. Yeah, look, I mean, Chibe's got nothing to lose, right? Like, I mean, he has a way, but he can make it back. Not anymore. Usually so, in any given kind of matchup, my eyes are drawn to McLeod, but no, I can't stop all, looking all, at Chibe right all, now. All eyes on Chib for this one. I love that down, it gets the knockdown. And yeah, just like force McLeod into the corner, like, uh, get it to tech away. Yeah. And then play the corner situation. It's a good way to think, right? Yep, okay. Wow. Ooh, big tipper. She dies. How did Chibe find the kill there? The down air to set up the tech situation, and then the cognizance to just quickly drop through, knowing that a tipper was just free at that point. Maybe he hella studied for this matchup, like, well in advance. There's off the ledge, gets the grab. Ooh, what a... Gets the re-grab, dude. That's, that's recognition. Okay. Another tech situation. Yeah, covers covers quite a bit with that uh, option escapes. coverage. Escape the uh, counter hit down smash. It is a man on a mission. Uh, power shield down smash in the cloud. Smash. Uh oh, the cloud misspacing that uh, that turn up down throw. It could have sealed Chip's fate. Pivot F smash. Seventy nine. Not gonna. Yeah, not gonna quite kill. But that's good damage. Some positioning damage. The cloud's gonna find the ground. She does. One more of those will uh, seal her fate though. Let's just roll. It was a good idea, but McLeod ready as always. Once you got, you got to push the lead here a little, Chib. You can't force the issue. Running in, getting counter hits. And McLeod's suddenly the one moving, right? Yeah. This is rough for Chib. I feel like, I hope the uh, duo dies not setting in for Chibe. It's all do. Never die. That could be big. The clouds are pretty gun at edge guarding Moth. There you so go. Quick. She grabs a ledge quick instant. On the ledge grab. Okay. Chibe. Oh. It's a tail as old as time, isn't it, Jordy? Going up. And you go up against the top player and suddenly the game slips away from your fingertips. Like a like a bag of sand. Another pivot F smash, not quite too high percent. I feel like wave dash forward up tilt might get you there. Think about that one, Chibe. Oh no, he gets hit off the ledge. 
Damn, Di the DIY was that away? Yeah. That's crazy. Oh my god. That's just uh I think it was at 60. That one stock of McLeod just it lasted forever. Yeah, it really just did not end. It was like a damn truck. And FD, the counter pick of choice for the young Marth player. I think that Marth is, uh, doesn't have a good uh, throw animation. For turnips, yeah. yeah. Even if you grab a turnip, you're kind of stuck with it. You, most Marths just D-drop it, I feel. Mm. The good ones, like Zayn. Yeah. You can, you can like full hop Z-drop and then like yeah. try to move forward a little. Yeah. You know, if you really have to have a plan for it, yeah. just throw it away. Oh, snipes the roll again. She's on it. Grabs the ledge, yep. So quick with it. Yeah. I mean, it's tough, right? Because even if you sneak on stage as Mark, like, could you get up into, like, Nair or Down Smash? is so killer, and McLeod juggling. I truly believe that, like... Circus Act, great power shield. Any player will, like, be significantly better if they practice just grabbing the ledge for, like, 10 minutes a day. Oh, yeah, gra like, wave dash back fast fall is, like, such a skill. Yeah. Or just, like, from a dash or anything, like, just get from wherever you are, just practice getting to the ledge. Wave dash back fast fall. So many players either don't go for it because they're not confident, or they just, like, miss it. Well, they just, they just kind of don't have it as a part of their flowchart. Yeah. Wow, that's really, that's, that's such an underrated thing that Cloud did there, is just like, instead of immediately punishing with Nair, move under to trick the DI. Mm. Like, just side swap the DI because you know that one Nair is going to send further away on bad DI from, from the right side to the left even. Yeah. Another pivot F smash. Not enough though. I mean, like, once the lead runs away from you from Peach, like, even, even good matchups like this, a super tough for Mark. Getting nothing off the throws. You got six minutes, Chibay. Don't be afraid to use them. That's what I say. If you're down against Mark, against uh, Peach, yeah, and, yeah, the DI away, expecting a weak hit. And we got a four stock locked and loaded from McLeod. Oh. All eyes on the lady in the, the white dress. Yeah, she's really stolen the show. We said all eyes on Chiba earlier. Oh, no. And uh, she might have hurt us because it's definitely all eyes back on the. Cloud Mark. Chiba's got a bit of a smile on his face. It's gone yeah, now. But, I mean, uh, you know, from here you kind of know the set's over. This is such a don't want to get four stocks. Oh, that was so cool. Yeah, the Z drop. Yeah, like the grab ledge, and in the meantime, doing the Z drop, just like covering so much. Really good stuff. Very clean. First off, uh, four Portio on stream. just gonna, he gotta, he's gonna enter the avatar state not only in the first two stocks of the set. Yeah.